Hey everyone, MTashed here with a Tips with Tash video, so we're going to be breaking down this guy's gameplay. I removed a lot of the fluff from this game because I really want to just break down a few main topics. So, one of the big things with this guy is even though he gets 29 kills, he has like a 3.5 kill death ratio or something like that, his target acquisition is junk. His aim very, very, very much needs to improve, and maybe it's just because he's not used to the Jade Rabbit, but he misses a lot of shots, and uh, unfortunately he really needs to pay attention to what's going on on the map, watch his radar, and stop being so damn aggressive. I'm going to break down some of those plays in a minute, but uh, let's get into it. You know, for the most part, he was pretty good, but he does a lot of stuff like this. So, he just ate a grenade, and if you look at his shots here, he's missing his target, he ate a grenade shot, or, you know, a grenade hit, and there was another guy that came into the zone. He should have ran long ago. And for whatever reason, it seems like whenever this guy's shooting his scout rifle, he's always a couple feet behind the guy. You know, he's always trying to almost catch up with his target, and sometimes he does, and he does get the kill. Right here, he gets a double, but he pulls the trigger so rapidly, it feels like he's almost getting lucky with his shots, which is unfortunate. One of the other big things is he does get a ton of super kills. Like, he gets 10, 15 kills with his super in the game. And that's not necessarily the best thing, because... He is using a scout rifle and a sniper, and it seems that he continues to push in and be aggressive because it's almost like he has this mentality that you got to be up close and personal to get kills. If you're using a scout rifle and a sniper, you better be back, you know, at the back of the map using them at a distance effectively. One of the next issues he has is uh, kind of not paying attention to his surroundings. So. Right there, he eats a Void Bow. I mean, yes, you can argue that it's very tough to tell if it's your own team or not, but he runs in, dies to a shotgun there, his super got ruined, essentially, and that is something that could have been avoided, but a lot of people would make that mistake. This one right here, though, this makes me cringe. He was hardscoping this doorway. His only job there was to shoot the guy coming through, and it took like five seconds for him to recognize it, and he does this quite a few times. You know, right there, there's a guy running in! And uh, he just, he took too long to recognize that he was in a troubled situation. Does he have some good supers? Yep. But then he does stuff like this, where that guy storm tranced, and he didn't recognize it. He didn't commit to that kill. So, you know, while he does do some smart things, he does make some nice plays. Look at these headshots, pegging that guy across the map. That's great. He does definitely need to work on his gun skill. That is the biggest thing is... If you're going to be using a scout rifle, you got to be landing your shots. They're high-impact shots from a distance that really have to connect. So don't be so aggressive. You know, pushing out with uh, low health, that is not good. And, you know, just pushing into people and being so close to engagement when you have a long-range weapon is not the smart play. Overall, he makes some good plays. You know, he throws a grenade there, gets a nice kill. Um, but, again... As soon as there seems to be someone on his radar or in his view, he pushes in and tries to attack them. You are a scout rifle user. Play back safe. Again, pushing in. Right here, he's low health. He's still committing. He's still committing. He's low health. And instead of playing the safe game, he's being the aggressor. And yes, he's getting kills, but I feel like a lot of his kills were bullshit luck because people just weren't paying attention when he pushed. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed the video, and have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.